Are you making a profit on Amazon? Well, you may not even know because you haven't put your cogs, your cost of goods directly into Amazon. My name is Stephen Pope. I'm the founder of My Amazon Guy. And in this video, I'm gonna walk you through how you can do just that. Start on the inventory page and click on one of these SKUs. When you click this, it's gonna load one of your detail pages, but on the back end here. And when you scroll down to the inventory section, you can see a little button here off to the right as you go down that says edit. The on cost of Amazon or off cost of Amazon, and this can help you calculate your cost of goods and your margins. So when you click it, here you go, cost of goods. I know that my cost of goods are probably right around $9.80 on this item. There's some miscellaneous costs like shipping costs. You could factor that in. Oop, looks like my video's on the way, I apologize. And over here, you could put in like, okay, I know it cost me 50 cents to pack this thing and get, you know, all that kind of regular stuff. So you hit okay, and then you can see your net proceeds. And so when you're selling your item, what are your net proceeds based on the item sales and all that good stuff? This is an item that has not been moving for me. It's got a sales rank of four freaking million. So we're going to run a sale on this and see if we can recover this one and see what we can do about it. I'm going to go over to one of my better seller units. This one's in the rank 20,000 BSR, one of the top selling incenses on Amazon. And we've sold over 2,400 units in the last 90 days, which you can see there right around that $9.96. As we scroll down to try and see how much money we're making on this, we're going to be able to calculate the net proceeds. Notice here I've got a net proceeds of $327, and I have not even put in my cost of goods yet. You can do the math already on this one. I'm running at a loss. So if we put in the cost of goods here and it's gonna be right around $4 for me, I'm gonna hit the okay button. And here you can see I am losing $2,700 a month on this product. Don't even need any fancy softwares, which I do recommend to Helium 10 here and there uh, to run this calculation. But there you go, you can see very quickly how much you're baking on a unit and what it's doing. And you can see it per unit, negative 356, the totals. And here you can quickly figure out, okay, where's the problem? So if we zoom in here, uh, zoom in function, total garbage, that didn't do too well. But on the right-hand side, you can see all of the charges and everything that's going on. So if the average sales price is 995, the units that have sold, Units that have returned, not really bad, not, not, not always really returning, so that's not the issue. But as we scroll down, there's this nice $3,800 we're spending on PPC. Well, that's what's killing this. $2,100 on fulfillment fees, that's about right. 1000 bucks on referral, oh, that seems about right. Transportation, none of these costs really killing me. If we had just been running this product without ads, $3,800, I'd be making about 1000 a month. Well, you have to run ads, and this is kind of becoming our loss leader. And so if we look at the product on Amazon, here's the, the why, why I'm doing that. Basically, I'm running the 6, the 12, and the 100 pack here and hoping that somebody will upgrade themselves and purchase one of these larger items. Well, the math, if it checks out, would allow me to run the 3 pack at a loss, but for how long? Should I be spending more of my advertising on the six and the 12? Maybe not enough people are clicking over there and making those purchases, and that's the question. Now that we've got a 1,000 reviews for the Amazon's Choice for Incense, we've got a decision to make. Do I start to try and make a profit on this? Do I pull the ads back? These are the questions that you're better prepared to answer when you start to put in your cost of goods and look for an actual profit assessment. So those are the questions that we looked at today. Let me know what your thoughts are. My name is Stephen Pope. I'm the founder of My Amazon Guy. Ask literally any question in the comments. I'll give you an answer. Hope you hear from me soon.